very precious sketchbook, which still remains intact by Holbein the Elder with his metal point sketches. Of these 80 years are crucial for the modern world. You might say, why choose 1460 to 1540? Why not, you know, 1540 to 1620? Completely different. What happened in this period is crucial for all of our own understanding of ourselves, the creation of modern Europe, the creation of modern thought, creation of modern religion. And so these drawings which come from that period are not only beautiful, but they also represent a, a crucial element of, of our history of culture. We start with the late medieval period and a kind of uh, what we normally call an international Gothic style, which has uh, figures elongated, very courtly, uh, gentle gestures. Um, and then comes the resurgence of interest in antiquity, the interest in ancient art and ancient culture. Then comes this sort of explosive political force of the Reformation. So you get all of these things working together, which help to create both uh, a, a new sense of style based on looking at the human figure and at individual personalities, and also the growth of multiple schools of style. Grunewald and Baldung, Hans Baldung Green, they both represent the, you might say, the emotional wing of German art, and, and their works are incredibly powerful. Very telling, they go straight to the heart.